hood is liquor stores and check cashing places. You know why? Because they know that the people in the hood aren't smart enough to open up bank accounts. They're going to get a check, they're going to cash it, and it's a liquor store right next to it. Let's just put that around them. Let's also put a bunch of shit that's easy and cash available. We don't want you to gain credit. We want you to be cash driven. That's how we keep the poor poor. It's not until you understand that you get out. Or Mr. Hart, black folk have to do with redlining, bombings, fires, and such like. And also Dominant Society is gonna make sure when they set up their neighborhoods, they're good. We have all these cash available places. That's not by chance, sir. That's by design. You know how I know? All right, so we're going to make this U-turn real quick. Because when I heard Kevin say that, I was like, hmm, you've been out of touch for a while, brother. You've been out of touch. So we're going to head northeast on Campbell towards West 7th and Fort Worth. And we're going to see all the financial institutions we can see on this one street, right? Or next to this one street. And this, I'm just saying, it's, it's a doozy to see how many are near this one street now. Right to our right, we have the first one. This is Origin Bank. Origin Bank. So I'll make this, we're going to whip just so you can get a nice clear view of it. This is the first financial institution. Financial institution. Origin Bank. And we're going to whip it back around. And head towards downtown. That's not a long drive. So I only ride for about five minutes. And we dip. Heading towards West 7th. Just so you have reference. I want you to have a reference of what's going on. Our neighborhoods are not set up the same. And when our neighborhoods are set up for us to succeed, or are set up for us to succeed, we get sabotaged, so. But you've been riding for a little bit. Where's the next financial institution? Well, here it comes. Quicker than you think. Boom, Simmons Bank. That's not even a mile. I don't think that's a, I don't think that's a half mile away from one another. Now, mind you, you can Google all this stuff. This is still here today. This is recent. See the timestamp. I'm gonna keep rolling, 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 rolling. And I'm not gonna cut up none of the footage. I could speed it up and all this. Nah, I want I want you to see it in real time so you can get the full effect of the distance and the drive time so you know what I'm talking about. Next financial institution coming up. Vantage Bank. Vantage Bank. Just so you know it's real. I think there was another one to the right. I think I might have missed it. If so, as you can see, I believe we're at what, three in already? With three in already? Next financial institution coming up. Should be to your right. Fort Worth Interbank. So it's another financial institution. What about four or five? Oh, there go another one. Encore Bank. Not even a full two blocks away. Another financial institution. One street. We've already driven what? Maybe what? Two miles now, three mi two and a half miles maybe. Come to light because you gotta slow down. Drive slow, homie. Drive slow, homie. So when Mr. Hart says what he says, I'm just saying. I, I when you see this in real time, it's kind of kind of sheds light on how things are set up for us. When we have prosperous neighborhoods, they get destroyed for a reason. This should be Frost Bank. Oh, this used to be a theater. You can tell by the way it's designed. Frost Bank. Another financial institution. 
And I think this is the last bank here. And I think the next one on the list should be a title company. Which if you're buying buildings and buying houses, a title company has an integral part in doing so. So yeah, there goes yep, title company. Now you can go through, watch it again, pause it for your uh, education. But that's that. So Mr. Hart, yeah, you, you kind of you kinda of tone the line, brother. I wanna chill on that. Peace and black empowerment.